Hello, friends and family from around the world. This is Mike with Daily Events Worldwide, and we are on July 8th, 2025. Welcome to another surviving day on the planet, and welcome to an earthquake update video here for you, as we did have a sizable 6.3 earthquake yesterday off the coast of southern New Zealand, 6.3 Riverton, New Zealand at a 22 kilometer depth. And then after that, we saw some very deep earthquake earthquakes in the Tonga region, and when we see deeper earthquakes, we're going to see larger, shallower earthquakes to follow. The deepest was 540 kilometer depth. And that's all in the last 24 hours. Also notable activity coming to Kilauea. Minor seismicity today, 2.5, but notable. 4.5 rare earthquake here, west of the Hawaiian Islands, Atoll region, Hawaii 4.5 earthquake. So a lot of pressure on the North Pacific plate right now. Activity increasing Alaska. And we've seen a lot of activity in Japan with that most recent volcanic eruption. Stay tuned. We've got some fascinating images to share with you tonight in the update. But let's carry on here. Across the North American plate, minor seismicity building all across California state and northward towards a dormant volcano, Mount Rainier. Here's a look at the last 24 hours. USGS reporting 264 earthquakes. Those are the regions that are on watch right now. Having a look, this is the last 24 hours. You can see earthquakes riding right up the San Andreas fault line and up into Petrolia and Bandon, Oregon. So heads up, my friends and family, hashtag no fear here. Just aware and prepared because we do have something building minor seismicity at mount st helens and an earthquake swarm here at mount rainier 40 earthquakes so far this morning out of the 264 that are being reported by usgs so stay tuned because these are right atop mount rainier 40 of them on the rim of the caldera the dormant volcano yet again awakening Stay tuned. It's been a while since we've reported earthquakes there. So this is a pretty big deal. Just if you live in an earthquake prone zone along the West Coast, just heads up, everybody. This is showing the last seven days for seismicity. And here's a look at Mount Rainier right now. Google Earth. Showing how dormant it is. Completely covered in snow. And this caldera is completely filled up. Now we've got an earthquake swarm on the rim of the caldera of Mount Rainier. If you enjoyed this information shared here today, please don't forget to give a thumbs up, share with your friends and family, keep sharing and caring. And thank you for almost 90,000 follows. We're pushing towards 100K here. Much love, stay safe and healthy, aware and prepared. We'll see you for tonight's update. Thank you.